Hey, good morning everybody. Welcome back to another adventure. Today, I'm at Mount Rainier National Park and I'm about to do two trails. The first trail I'm going to do is the Nisqually Vista Trail, which is about 1.2 miles. And then after that, I'm doing the famous Skyline Trail, which is about five miles round trip. First one is labeled as easy. The second one is labeled as strenuous. So the Skyline Trail is 1,700 feet of elevation gain. Today looks really good. It's a little cloudy, but uh, definitely not rainy. So I'm not 100% sure, but I think this might be the Nisqually Vista point. Mount Rainier, unfortunately, is still covered in fog. So the cool thing is you can actually totally see and hear the water coming down Mount Rainier. Just listen. So there are actually multiple Vista points on the Nisqually Vista. Now that is the biggest wild mushroom I've ever seen. I wonder if it makes you hallucinate. <laughs> So I'm all done with the Nisqually Vista Trail and heading now to the Skyline Trail. So now I'm officially on the Skyline Trail. Let's do this. All right, so two cool things just happened. One, I just ran into a marmot. Number two, Mount Rainier just started to pop out of the clouds. Look at that mighty Mount Rainier right behind me. Isn't that amazing? It's huge. You know, you can see it all the way from Seattle and even further. And then just like that, Mount Rainier disappears again. They don't seem to be scared of people. They come pretty close. We just gotta keep going up and up and up. So Mount Rainier decided to pop back out of the clouds again. This trail is a little bit of a butt kicker, but it is so awesome. I'm taking my time with it, enjoying the beauty. I feel like the temperature has gone down a little bit too, the higher I go up. I've only done half the hike already. It felt like it's been a lot longer than 2.5 miles. I know this is a five mile hike. I could take a shortcut, but I want to do this whole trail. Looks like the trail's starting to go down there. So the good thing is the second half of the hike has been sunny and clear.
I love how the landscape of this hike is consistently changing. So there's a lot of great variety in this trail. Oh look, the trail is a stream now. <laughs> Interesting. Rainier National Park is truly a beautiful place. You know, if you only got time to do one trail, I would say do the Skyline Trail. It's funny because just now these two young girls uh, saw me as I came around the corner and they got scared. They thought I was a bear because I guess somebody told them there was a bear somewhere up here. I got a little bit of an added bonus for you guys. We're gonna check out a waterfall called Myrtle Falls on the way back to the car. Now usually you can see Mount Rainier above it, which it makes it more dramatic, but I'll definitely stick a picture of what that looked like the last time I was here like three years ago. All right, so I'm almost at the very end of the trail. This hike was extremely awesome. Like probably I'd say one of my top 10 hikes that I've ever done. Very scenic, very beautiful. Um, dramatic scenery, just insane. I do have a trip to Lake Tahoe coming up in a couple of weeks. And then I know right after that, I have a trip planned out to uh, Mammoth Lakes and Yosemite National Park again. I want to thank you so much for joining me on another adventure today. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. Love to bring you with me on future adventures. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.